Ladies and gents, welcome to the Shropshire Mafia Christmas Camp 2021. Um, hey. So, hello. Uh, on deck this evening we have uh, myself, Wild Astro. Oh, we have John. Hello. We have John Hughes. There he is. We have the legend that is uh, Dave Outdoors. Uh, Shropshire lad Gordon Jackson over there. Cheers, and we have uh, Mike Jock got one. Jock One there, over there. Okay. So, um, <laughs> so I thought what I'd do. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> so I thought what I'd try and do between <laughs> the eruptions of laughter this evening is a little bit of a, a Gordon Ramsay, Jamie Oliver kind of. Um, you know, mulled cider segment. We've all had plenty to drink this evening uh, so far. The mulled wine has disappeared, but actually what I'm going to do with the mulled cider is uh, pretty much the same as I do with the mulled wine. Um, but we'll see. Uh, I'm going to I'm going to turn you around in a minute. We've got a lovely fire going with a nice grill. I'm going to put a pan on it. I've got loads of nice, nice cloudy cider to mull and I'm going to talk you through it just like I did with last year's cocktails. Um, so I'm going to get Dave on camera, uh, and uh, I don't know, Gordon and Gordon and John might choose to do. Oh, I've got I've got a job for John. John's going to stud me Clementines, and uh, no, cheap. Gordon's going to sit there and just wait to be plied with more alcohol. Chief Clementine Studder. John's chief studder this evening. Here we go. All right, so I'm going to try and do my Gordon Ramsay thing, and I'm going to do my Jamie Oliver thing, and we're going to. Here's a pan, big pan, and here is three litres of nice cloudy cider, okay? And what we're gonna do, we're gonna mold this cider, we're gonna make us a cracking Christmas drink. Is a, yeah, well John is, John is studding clementines with cloves at the moment. <laughs> good, isn't he? Proper natural. Somewhere over there I've got a potato peeler. Can someone try and find my potato peeler? Oh, it might be oh, in, hang the on. in the bag. <coughs> yeah, that's, that's a potato. Potato, that's potato peeler. Definitely a potato peeler. Right, what I'm gonna do, I'm going to take, see that? That's a lime. That's not a lime, it's a small apple. It's a lime. <laughs> I'm going to peel the lime. <laughs> okay, and the first thing that's going to go in the pan is that, is the skin, is the, the rind off the lime. There it goes. Boom. Boom. All of that. Feel free to film it all, Dave, but I'm going to edit most of this out. I'm going to put the juice from that lime, both of those two limes in there as well. Last one. So, two lime skins and two lime juices in there. Now, don't worry about the red that you can see over here. That's from where we had the mulled wine in the pan earlier. No problem. Right, now I've got a lemon. I'm going to do exactly the same with that. <laughs> right then so we've got two limes and a lemon in there right okay cinnamon sticks cinnamon sticks are next boom two of them in there straight in no messing bay leaves here i've got bay leaves i'm going to go one two three four one for luck there we go bay leaves are in there as well Right, these are star anise. Not many people know what these are, but this is where your flavor of aniseed comes from. Okay, and what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take about that much. There we go. Boom, straight in the pan. Boom. Boom, straight in the pan. Straight in the pan. Straight in the pan. Pan boom, down, boom. pan down, babe. Shake the room. He put it straight in the pan, John. Pan put it in the pan. He put pan. it in the pan, man. Pan down. Pan down. Pan down. Pan down. Pan down. I feel I'm being taken the piss out of here somehow. Right. Okay, now what I've got here is two, I've got two vanilla pods here. Now these are expensive, boys and girls. They're about six pound a pair. And I'm gonna... Leave them out. Yeah, you can leave them out if you want to. You can use normal, van, you know, like vanilla paste or something like that. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna split them down the middle and I'm gonna wang them straight in there as well. Straight in. Straight in. No messing, hang on. Let me get the bush lure on this one. Oosh. There we go. Right. Split them down the middle, like that. Get them in there. You want loads of lovely vanilla seeds in there. Okay, next. Is that a bit of your thumb supposed to be in there? No. Right, this is this is maple syrup. Maple syrup's gonna go in there. There we go. That's about a quarter of a bottle of maple syrup. That's a 
It's a 275 gram bottle of maple syrup and I've put about a quarter of it in there. Now, because this is cider, I'm not putting any sugar in there. Okay, very last thing we're gonna add to this, we've got a nutmeg here, oh. a whole nutmeg, and we're gonna grate it, small grater. Say what? my tangerines, that looks good. my tangerines. We're gonna grate about, what, a third? About a third of the nutmeg into the pan there. Looks beautiful, look how festive that looks. Beautiful. Right then, now we're gonna heat that. We're gonna let that heat over the flames for a bit until we start to get the flavors of the cinnamon and the and all the citrus through all of the maple syrup. <coughs> what? Clementines. Clementines are looking Don't a bit worry. lonely. Don't worry, fear not. John has been studying clementines for me. He's been doing them much lately. See, it's not bad. They're like perfect. They look like um, those. Vivian those are going to float ones, in the <coughs> cider. We're going to float the clementines in the cider in a few in a few minutes' time. Okay, so this is going to be absolutely beautiful. Oh, and uh, and I have to just point this out to you, amaretto here. Oh, this wow. is this this goes in right at the very end because we don't want to burn the alcohol off. On the way to amaretto. <laughs> <laughs> I've got three liters of cloudy cider here. It's all going in. It's all going in. All going in. Oh yeah. Christmas camp, by the way, with the Shropshire Mafia. Merry Christmas. Hi. Yes. Merry Christmas, everybody. All the subscribers of Wild Astro. Merry Christmas to you all. This is Jock Wan, featuring Evening. for the first time on Wild Astro. Oh. I almost said Dave Outdoors then, but it's Wild Did Astro, you? isn't it's it? It's Wild yeah. Astro. Yeah. Anyway. Back to the cloudy cider. Don't forget, oh. if you go over to Rich's channel and drop him your details, he'll send you a sticker. I will. This is true. Free Wild Astro <laughs> sticker. Tell him more Astro so One sticker, man. Are you making it for and it's pretty hell, sticky. Right then, what we're going to do is we're going to let that heat. John, Clementines. I want it. <laughs> you, got, you, got, you got one job. One job, that's all you had, John. John, put them in the, put them <laughs> in the pan, job, kid. John. One job, John. Hey. Chuck them in, John. Like Thank you, up. John. Okay, oh, John, you remind me Thank of Russ. Right, now listen. We do not let this boil. Because if we let this boil, we've lost alcohol. All right? We let this get to the point where these these clementines, the there's bubbles coming out of where the cloves are studded with them. Okay? This is the important thing. When you start to see the cloves bubbling, just just squirting little bubbles out the side of the clementines. It's ready. It's hot enough. Okay, you do not ever boil it. Do we have to make a spell? So yeah. Uh, a fight, okay. Yeah, already... you sound. Uh... So, ladies and gents, uh, while the mold cider is heating up there, um, I've joined. Uh, I've joined Dave outdoors here. Thanks for having me, mate. Appreciate it. Thanks very good much. Good to see you, man. Yeah, very good to see you. It's too. Dave's birthday. He's 36. Hey, He's 36. That's I know he looks old. Because it's his birthday, I've gifted Dave a nice Polly's Brewery uh, IPA here. What we've got here is Rosa, which is a double IPA from Polly's Brewery. It's 8.5%, which means it's an absolute belter of an IPA. And uh, it's probably going to destroy us. What's Jackson no, doing back I'm there? Just, just joining in. Fun. All right, lads. Oh, yeah. Gordon Jackson's here. He's probably going to try this IPA as well. Come on, round of applause oh, for Gordon round of Jackson. Applause for Gordon Come on, Jackson. Jackson. Hey. There he is. <laughs> Legend himself. Anyway, <laughs> let's get these open. Dave, shall we? We're doing it. Let's do it. Right. Here we go. One, two, three. All right. Nose full first. Okay, the citrus is there. Yeah, citrus looking in front of it. I can smell the citrus yeah. already. Okay, lots of lemon. Right. time. Go on, off you go. <sighs> oh, citrus from the off, mate. That's nice. Oh. It's juicy. Oh, yeah. There's lemon in that, isn't there? There Lot is lemon in that. Straight from the off, you can. Yeah. Juicy. Uh, whoa. Very whoa. good, that right, is. It's amazing. It's, it's really, really good. You can, the 8.5% the, the, the is a bit, of a, a bit of a kick in the face. But, yeah, really, really good IPA, that is. Um, 
Oh, that's nice, that is, mate. That is nice. Follow that out, follow that out, Bob. What? Yeah, it's got a very lemony taste to it. If you've got taste buds that are not very sour required, this isn't the one for you. But that is very nice. Cheers, Dave. Cheers, Ricardo. Top man. Happy Astro. birthday, kid. Happy Cheers. Birthday. Thank you very much. We're on the Christmas camp with the uh, Shropshire Mafia. It's 2021. It's been quite a poor year, actually, for some of us. But then we met her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we studied that all year, Addy. <laughs> okay, so it's heated right through now. And what we're going to do, uh, we're just going to add some amaretto to this mixture. And it's about, I don't know, it's about two shots of amaretto per litre, something like that. Possibly a bit more, depending on your personal taste. Carefully measured, Rick. I like a lot of it. Um, I measure it very carefully, as Gordon has pointed out. It's, uh, my, my personal measurement is just as it leaks out of the tin, pan. Touching the rim. As it touches the rim. Hey. Calibrated bottle, mate. It's right nice, it is, like. <laughs> And I'll give you a shout as soon as this is heated right through and ready to drink. Okay, folks, here we are, we're ready to serve. So what we've got in here is, we've got vanilla, star anise, citrus peel and juice, bay leaves, <laughs> clementines and cloves, cinnamon, uh, some grated nutmeg, and maple syrup. And of course, we added that amaretto right at the end as well. That looks nice, doesn't it? It's delicious. I love the way they've been had their little black things shoved into them, John. Oh, John, you've got a leaf, man. You've got a leaf, John. John, leaf. Get it down, you. Let's see what you think, John. <laughs> Clement. <laughs> oh, that is so. nice. Oh, don't like so that the Shropshire Mafia, down. the Shropshire Mafia are just laying into this mold cider. What do we think, John? That is absolutely <laughs> fantastic. Yeah, John's loving it. John's loving it. Michael, how are we? I'm superb. You're superb. How's this, the cider? This is excellent. This is superb. Excellent. Steady on, steady raw. Take it easy, Michael. Now the true test. Dave outdoors. Oh yeah. How's the mulled cider, Dave? <laughs> Shite. It's very nice, Richard. Thank you ever so much for doing the mulled wine and the cider. <laughs> <laughs> He's very restrained tonight. <laughs> I'm trying to be sensible for sake. <laughs> Are you trying to be sensible because this is Wild Astro and not Dave Outdoors? It's Astro one, no, Wild Astro, not Dave Outdoors. Yeah, so yeah, right. what you said, yeah. If this is Dave Outdoors, how would you describe the cider you've just drunk? Epic. <laughs> 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 Yes, Richard, like it. <laughs> well, hey, yeah. oh. Are you happy there? Well, folks, that. that's it. I'm going to say good evening. I'll film a little bit in the morning as I'm packing the way and we're tidying everything away here. But uh, as far <laughs> as far as filming tonight is concerned, we're done. And we'd like to say very Merry Christmas to all of you. Uh, it's been a pleasure producing content for you this year and um, we'll see you in 2022. Uh, have a great Christmas, a very happy new year. Dave Outdoors is making his way around here at the moment. I'm sure there's a reason for it. Have Can a good have one, Shaq. Can we have a shout out? Michael wants to do a shout out to... Backpack and 
Bruises. Oh, oh, backpacks and bruises. Plural, mate, backpacks. Big up backpacks and bruises. <laughs> Folks, I'd like to say night night. I'm going to bed. Night. Night night. This is Wild Astro signing off. Signing off. He's signing off. Good night. They've 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 said it. This is Richie for Wild Astro. Signing off. Hey.